Welcome to Math with Mr. J. So here we are at the expanded form to standard form mastery check where you are going to try some of these on your own to see if you have it down. If you're looking for more of an instructional or help video, I added the link to that video down in the description. So go and check that out and then come back to the mastery check. If you're ready to try these on your own, in a second here, I'm going to say pause. You'll pause the video, solve these five, you need to put them in standard form. When you're done, go ahead and press play and check your answers with mine to see if you have it down. So you should have something out to write with and write on and go ahead and press pause. All right, welcome back. I'm assuming you have those five uh, done there, so let's see how you do. Your goal, I would say, would be to have four out of the five here. So let's start with number one, and we start with a nine in the hundreds place. Next, we have a seven in the tens. And then lastly, we have a nine in the ones place. So a nine with the value of 900, a seven with a value of 70, and a nine with a value of nine. So for number one, 979. Number two, we start with a six, and it's in the hundred thousands place. The next place is the ten thousands place, and we have a, a one there. The next place would be the thousands, which is not listed in our expanded form, but we still need a placeholder zero there. Then a comma. The hundreds place should have a zero. Then we have a four in the tens place. And then we need a zero in the ones place. So 610,040. Number three, we start with a seven with a value of 70 or seven in the tens place. Then a three in the ones. We do not have any tenths after the decimal. Then we have a five in the hundredths and a two in the thousandths. So 73 and 52 thousandths. Number four, we start with a three in the ones place, then a decimal, an eight in the tenths, we do not have any hundredths, and then a one in the thousandths. So three and 801 thousandths. Lastly here, we have a three with a value of 300 or a three in the hundred, hundreds place. We do not have any tens. We have one in the ones place, decimal, we do not have any tenths, so we need a zero there, two in the hundredths, and then nine in the thousandths. Uh, so for number five, 301 and 29 thousandths. So there you have it. There's the expanded form to standard form mastery check. Thanks so much for watching. Until next time, peace.